Hello, I'm going to show you how to make a muzzle flash in Windows Movie Maker. Uh, everything I'm about to show you is 100% free, so you don't have to worry about paying money for Adobe Fireworks or Photoshop for editing the image. Okay, first go to Internet. Mm -hmm. Then you want to search paint dot net Google search right here this first one you click then to the right of the page you want to click get paint that and once you're here um, there's a lot of stuff on this page and all you want to do is you just want to click paint dot net version 3 3.6 there's all these all places you can download it from I download now is the easiest right here because you just go right here and you download it once you have downloaded paint.net uh, now you want to open movie maker you import your movie this is mine um, you watch it okay that's the original footage now you're gonna want to import this put this down to the timeline um, right here where it says zoom timeline in click that until you can't zoom it in anymore and right here you can move it frame by frame so there's the first frame and you find out the frame you want the gunshot to be these two frames are the ones I want so you're gonna click take a picture I've already saved these ones so I don't need to and right where you took the picture split the clip okay then you go into the next frame take a picture split okay once you've done that you're gonna go back to the internet and search a uh, muzzle flash oops um here you're going to want this one probably cuz this is the best one you can use so save this image say so save image as muzzle flash just I've already saved it Okay. Then once you've already, you've saved it, you are going to open paint.net. And what this is going to do, you're going to uh click open. Oh yeah, make by the way, make sure you've installed paint.net <laughs> before you do this. Okay, now what you're going to do is you're going to open up your picture the muzzle flash picture that you saved earlier um... mine is saved in the desktop you're gonna open the picture up and you have all this black here you don't want the black in your picture because it's gonna look weird so what you'll do is select a magic wand but first I need to go up to that layers and say flip horizontally because that's not the way I'm gonna want it now once you have I've flipped it I'm going to select it with the magic wand just right in the middle of the flash and go up and cut. Just press cut. Um, this will cut the entire picture out. And now go over and open <clears throat> the picture of you shooting the gun that you saved in Windows Movie Maker. There's my picture. Now you're just gonna click, uh, just press 
the two buttons control and V or paste and there's little corners and stuff that you can size the flash with I'm sizing it to the size I want and you can and there is your module flash now you just do this to the next picture um, and save it um, do remember to remember to paste it in a you can do this with any muzzle Um, you're going to go import the picture of you with the muzzle flash. Um, can't remember where mine is. Oh, in my pictures. No, this isn't it. Um, gotta go back. Oh, right here. Um, go click on your muzzle flash. Uh, select both of them and import them into the library and there are your little pictures okay once you have those pictures imported you're going to um, where you split those two clips before you're going to put the pictures in to right where you split them okay I have one picture in there where I split it. Um, now I'm going to put the other picture in the middle. Um, it should look like this. Hold on. Let me watch it. Boom. That's what it should look like. Um, but but make sure that when you're before you're doing this, you put in effects and delete the image that's in the middle of this so there there's your picture 